Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, it's Spires, the developer Stardust, and I would like to show you all a few tips and tricks on how to improve your life if you really don't like the radial menu. Yeah, so I'm getting a lot of uh, complaints about the radial, radial menu, that it's bad, that you have to click a lot of times to get somewhere, and then if you want to change a tile, you need to do 20 more clicks. Like one, two, three, four, five more clicks. So the answer is no, you don't have to do this. It's just uh, there are some tools and some techniques and some shortcuts to make your life easier. So let me show you all the tricks you can do. Trick number one with the radial menu. If you're deep inside the radial menu and you want to close this, you don't have to do one, two, three, four, five right mouse button clicks to exit. You can do double click the right, the right mouse button double click. So click, click, and it's out. So that's one trick. Another trick, uh, you can always build a copy of the object instead of going to find, uh, going uh, and trying to find it through the radial menu. So you can just press B when anything is selected and you're going to be building that thing. Uh, there's also a right click context menu, build a copy which has the shortcut B here. So you can use uh, that. Uh, then, of course, there is the tab menu, which is the most most important thing you can use uh, to save time. So you know that you want to build a floor, you just type floor, and you can then use mouse, uh, you can use the arrow keys or the mouse scroll to scroll through the uh, options. And you'll see like the tooltips and you'll see uh, what you want and then you'll be able to order the stuff. If you want to build a device that you know the name of, like nutrient extractor, hit tab, type nutrient, not, it will already autocomplete and hit enter. And now you're in the nutrient extractor, extractor building mode. So uh, there, there is even more. In this game, I have loaded a save file of someone. Oh no, there's there's the bottom. Yeah, I'm on a widescreen monitor, so I have to do this trickery to show you the full <coughs> the full game. Yeah, so here in the bottom we have the hotbar. If you click this I button, you'll see how to use the hotbar. So whenever you have something in the radial menu that you like uh, to build off, and let's say you like connectors. So let's go to electricity, let's find like the floor socket and hold control and click it. And now you can see the floor socket appeared in the bottom right here. You can also add like charge station, battery, anything you're building like at the time. For example, if you like to build a lot of walls, you could add reinforced wall, regular wall, vent, uh, you can add airlocks and doors. So the bottom menu will get wider and you have the shortcuts here. So you want to build a wall, one, two, three, four. I'm gonna switch to airlock, build an airlock here. Uh, switch to this, build some connectors, very quick. And if you want to remove this here, you just hold control and click and it will remove the items from this. You can also remove the ones that were pre-set here before and make this bottom hotbar your own. So uh, one more thing about connectors you can build a new connector just by dragging and releasing it on the floor and then you'll have the options of what connectors can be built. And this is also a quick way to build the connector so you don't have to go through the radial menu. And yeah, there's also shortcuts. Like for example, if you want to go to deconstruct, you can just press X. You don't have to do this and go to deconstruct. Right, so this is the reason why I'm not really eager to replace the radial menu with something else, because there's already like at least several alternatives on how you can quickly build things and how you can uh, like avoid going through the radial menu at all if you don't like using it. So yeah, I really suggest to look at how the tab menu works, because this is the most powerful tool in the game, uh, and it really, really solves a lot of problems that people have with the radial menu. Also, the tab uh, works in the research tree. So if you go to the research tree, you can hit tab and type nutrient and uh, it will jump to the nutrient extractor and so on. So yeah, thanks for watching. I hope I, can, I convinced you that the radial menu is not that horrible 
uh, at least when there's some alternatives. Uh, so yeah, I hope you have an, uh, I hope you have a great time playing Star Deus. But I'm not actually saying that I will never change the radial menu. I'm just saying that there are some alternatives and uh, that I would like to first allow people to explore the alternatives for a bit longer before I start rebuilding the thing that works. Yeah, so with that said, uh, give tab menu a shot, give the hotbar in the bottom a shot, and um, radial menu might be improved at some point. Yeah, it might. Uh, there might be some alternative added, but it's not going to be soon, because right now, right after launch, there's a lot of content that is missing, there's a lot of uh, mechanics that are missing, and uh, while there are three options, and uh, to build new stuff. Uh, there's not enough content to work with, so I would rather do something that is missing that uh, than change something that has already a lot of alternatives to it. So that's why that's why the radio menu will remain as it is for a while. Alright, that's it. That's all I wanted to say. Thanks for watching and see you next time.